like the speed of sound We can keep on the ground What's good YouTube? Easy now 1337 aka Snow here today with my G1 Optimus Prime and if you don't know what G1 is I suggest you just get off now <laughs> next week guys you're going to see Pokemon week I got Darkrai, Togepi, Gengar and Hitmonchan at the moment and I am making some more fun to catch you'll probably see later but let's get into Optimus Prime what you want to do first is hop in and grab one of these change it black make it smaller and stretch it out by going down and to the right and up, up and to the right as well but you want this one to be sort of at an angle like that that angle but obviously not that obvious so just pop it about there that looks good duplicate that layer uh, move it across and we're going to have it this way this time but we'll obviously just make it a bit less obvious as well sorted Duplicate layer 1 by pressing select or back on it, move up and press start, make that red, I just go with this red and make that smaller. So the red is outlined by the black. Next duplicate layer 2, jump up, do the same thing, make it red, make it just a bit smaller and then move that layer down to the bottom and then move the black layer down to the bottom as well. So then that's going to leave a black outline going down the middle of his chest and I'm just going to make that a bit bigger actually so it doesn't curl at the bottom just like so perfect now next you want to go in and grab any form of straight line hold on I just said something Let me just mess around with that make it a bit bigger and we just get it to that position like so Go in and grab a straight line, change it black, make it smaller and we're going to skew this up and to the left until we get a straight line like so. And duplicate it and have it going the other way like so. Perfect. Next you want to go in and grab a square, normal square, one of these bring it down, this is going to be like his chest window as it's called make that black duplicate it and make it to a light blue I think I used this one, one of these two I got that one and make it smaller, next go in and grab what, what did I grab now, what did I use was it this one? Let's have a look. Yeah, it was that one, but I pressed, um, I skewed it down into the right so it's not so latent. Duplicate that, make it the same colour blue as the other window. Is it that colour? Is that the same colour? Nope. There we go. And just bang that in as his other chest window piece thing. You know what I mean? And now it's time to work on his head. Well, no, actually, we'll just. Or will we? What will I do? What will I do? I don't know. Yeah, we'll do his head next. Um, now I just gotta figure out what I used. I think I used this here. Change that to grey. I used a light grey. Flip it around. And we're gonna skew this by going up and to the left. And we get it to about there. Just gonna make that a bit bigger. And then move this all the way down to the bottom, like so. Now there's gonna be a lot of moving down to the bottom as we go along. So be prepared for that. Next, go in and grab this thing, the tube. Make it a slightly darker grey than the one you've already used. We're just gonna line it up here, like so, and then move it all the way down. And that's just gonna be his face, take this one and flip it so that the the uh, points, how can I put it, how can I put it, like the curve isn't slap bang in the middle, it's more to the right, see what I mean, so it looks like he's looking off to the right, so yeah, if that makes sense, it does, it doesn't, it doesn't, <laughs> um, next, grab something which I can't remember, 
I think it's a triangle. Oh no, I forgot what I was doing. <laughs> Tell you what, grab one of these, change it to a blue. I can't remember which blue I used exactly, I think it was that one. Make it smaller, move it all the way down to the bottom layer. This will just give me a better, a better look on things. And just sort of turn it to the right-ish. And just circle his head like so. And then that can be built on now. So go in and grab a triangle, make it the same blue. Now you don't have to move these ones down if you don't want to, but I did in my one just so I know, knew where everything was. And just sort of add that to the side of his head. Like so, duplicate it, flip it, turn it, whatever you want to do. And just add it on to the side there. We'll fix it up in a second. What you want to do is go in and grab this, change it to the same color blue, uh, flip it, move it down, and we're just going to slot it in there like so. And now we can move that one all the way down to the bottom. Now you can just play with it, make it a bit bigger. Skew it down to the right if you like. Don't worry, it will look a bit better than it's looking at the moment. I just have to work on it. Um, next grab... I think it was this again. Change it to grey. That's too dark of a grey. Flip that around, make it smaller. Uh, skew it by going up and to the left. I'm going to place it about there. Now, what you do need for this emblem is a ladder sign, which is here. Get five kills within three seconds of climbing over an object or through a window. Now, I don't think that's five kills in one go. I think that's separate occasions. I'm pretty sure everyone will have this emblem. If you don't, just try and get it by climbing through windows or climbing up an object. Change it black, make it smaller. And skew it by going up and to the left. And just down and to the right, just to make it perfect, like so. Then we're going to go in and grab one of these, change it to the same blue that we were using. Move it down below the grey. And skew it by going up and to the left. And just sort of adding it onto the top there, like so. Now that we can see a bit better, I'm going to make the head. Just keep messing with it till you get something you like. I'm just going to move that over a bit. I tell you what, move the one, the ear, one ear down, the one on the right. Move it down below the greys. And nice, like that. I'm just going to make his face a bit thinner. So let's move that over a bit. Make it a bit bigger. And it's just about messing with it till you get to something you like, guys, as always. And where is this other here? Make that a bit bigger. Righty, oh, sorted. Now I'm just going to grab a semicircle, make that blue. And I'm just going to shove it on the side of his head right here. You can skew this by going up and to the left if you like. If you don't like, don't bother, up to you. Then grab a circle and change it black, make it smaller. Outline it by pressing start, as you can see what I'm doing there. And then make it smaller and skew it so that it fits between the grey eye section and the blue semicircle you just fit out. Just so it looks like an extra thing on the side of his head, if that makes sense. <laughs> um, go in and grab the same things you use for the shape of the face, eyes thing. Make it a light blue, make it smaller. And just bang it anywhere in there, duplicate it. And I'm just gonna flip that round. Try and make the one on the the eye on the right smaller and thinner, because obviously it's supposed to be further away because like he's looking towards the right, if that makes sense. 
and what I also did was grabbed a semicircle and just skewed it by going up and to the left oh wrong thing now uh, this is just just to add a bit of depth so you don't need much opacity like seven percent I'd say move it down so it's below the red chest area like so perfect perfect and what else did I have on here? Oh yeah, I had um, the little red circles. So change, get a circle, change it black, make it smaller. And duplicate that layer and just move it across next to it, like so. And then duplicate both those layers, change them to the same red as the chest and make them smaller, like so. Make sure there's a gap between them so you can actually see them like touching each other on the sides. That makes no sense whatsoever. Hopefully, you'll understand exactly like that. And then duplicate the layers again and move them over. Make them a bit smaller for this side because it's supposed to be further away again. Make it red, make it smaller. Duplicate that layer, put it next to it, and there we go, sorted. So that is my G1 Optimus Prime done. In the actual, when I made it, when I first made it, I made him a lot smaller, a lot shorter. Um, made his head a lot smaller because it was just me being bang on accurate, trying to get what I want to get. But I actually like this one a bit better actually because it looks bigger. It takes up more of the emblem. It's totally up to you guys. Take it, mess around with it do what you gotta do with it and make it your own that's me done for today though guys hopefully fund the cats up later but that was a really hard emblem to make and i'm gonna have to practice before i attempt to remake it for youtube anyway that's me done hope you enjoyed that peace out take care uh,